Yo, what is going on with Bulls management, man? What is going on with Bulls management? Tell me what is going Jimmy Butler? God? What is go- What? Derrick Rose, Jimmy Butler, crackers and soup. That's what we're left with, crackers and soup. We got who? Who? His last name is like three first names. He better shoot, man. He better be good at shooting. Hello, YouTube fam. I have one thing to say, and it's to the Bulls management. What the heck are you doing with my team? Just, just put me in the office, man. How you gonna give up? I get it. You know, Derrick Rose is hurt. You wanna, you know, stake with Jimmy Butler. He's come. Okay, cool. So get rid of Rose. I was already, my, my heart was already broken. And then, two years later, when Jimmy's like at an all star, almost like MVP level, you get rid of him too. And then you send them for Chris Dunn and Zach Levine. They're great players. I get it. But for Jimmy Butler, you give him up for Chris Dunn. Zach Levine, and then you get a guy named Lori Markonovan. His last name is like three first names. Like, I just, I don't know what to think. Guard packs, so the two managers, what, are, what is your thought press? Like, what is your thought process? You trying to rebuild? Okay, so you wanna get rid of somebody with a knee injury, right? Okay, I get that. I was a little hurt about that, right? My favorite player in the world. Right, other than Michael Jordan, you get rid of him. Then you get Dwayne Raid. Respect to you, man. Respect to you. Another guy with a knee injury, and then you grab another guy who had an ACL tear. Zach Levine. Like, like, yo, I, I just don't know what to say. I don't know what you guys are doing. Yeah, I'm still wearing this because this is gonna be the last night I can wear this, man. And I got this jersey this year, man. I had to, you know, I was trying to hold out. You know, with my Derrick Rose jersey, had to get rid of it. I, I understood. I was like, I, I gotta get rid of it. I got to get a new one. Jimmy Butler is gonna be the new history and the new future. Not new history. He is now the new history, the new future. And like, dude, I, I, I just have no clue what to think now, man. Like, I'm lost for words. Like, like, just watch this, man. Like, when I heard, they're like, oh, okay. Oh, uh, there's a big trade going on. Big trade going on. And deal with Jimmy Butler. I was like, I was wearing my jersey and I was like, please don't be not great. He's going with his old coach, Tom Thibodeau. Da -da -da -da. I was like, dang it, man. So, so I gotta say this. Hey, Timberwolves, y'all got it. I'm gonna go ahead and say you're gonna be a playoff team next year. Not only you have Ricky Rubio, you got Jimmy Butler. You have Carl Anthony Towns, you got Okafor, you got freaking, uh, what's that boy's name? Wiggins, like you got a squad. And like I said, I'm not trying to diss Levine, I'm not trying to diss this done, but what are you doing to our team? If you're gonna try to start, we just, we literally just got our 11th point guard, right? We got Cameron Payne, we got Ray John Rondo, we got Michael Carter Williams, we got, um, who else? We got Jerry and Grant. We got Denzel Valentine. How many guards do we need on our team? Nobody can shoot. So we get one shooter, Larry McConaughey. And he's a rookie, man. Boy, we also got Nico. I respect you, Nico. We got you. And then earlier, remember, earlier in the year, we gave up Todd Gibson, Doug McDermott. So we're trying to rebuild, but we gave away like the best shooter that we had, right? Makes sense. Not at all. So. I'm gonna end this right by saying, look, I'm gonna see where we're at next year, see what moves we make. I know Dwayne's not gonna be happy. Wade's like, I stay here for Jimmy. You know, Rondo came here for, for Jimmy. So what we gotta do now? I have no clue. Jimmy's probably at home saying, dang. He's like, I don't wanna go to Cavs, I wanna stay with the Bulls. So what, what do the Bulls do? Oh, you don't wanna go to Cavs? We're gonna send you to the Timberwolves. See ya, bye bye. What? Hey, anyway, like I said, best of luck to you, Jimmy. Respect to you, man. Bulls management.
Whatever you're smoking up there needs to stop. All right? Y'all need to get our team back together. We need to be back to the to the old school Bulls where we were feared, feared for our defense, feared for at home. You know, like, I just don't think, man. Anyway, hope you guys enjoy. I can't even say embrace the hype, man. Embrace the, I don't know, embrace the future of the Bulls, man. I'll see y'all later.